Empire Station. Cherish you from head to toe. In my world, I have nothing to give to you to prove my love for you. of the meeting that you told your mother and I that you were going to attend today. You left home to come and stay with this commoner. 
He's not a common man. Shut up! <laughs> Look! You can be the strongest of them in this kingdom. That does not give you the right to, to eat with the noble. Stand up for my daughter! the both of you. You two taught me to always associate myself with people that matter. People that are influential. Yes. So, why can't I be with Dickie? He is influential. No! He is not! Yes, he is. He is strong. He is a young man that has distinguished himself in wrestling. He has wrestled with men and spirits and return victorious. He may have achieved all this, but that does not mean that he is a noble. Nobility runs in the blood. It's not something you get out of wrestling. I am not a wrestler, yet I am a influential in this kingdom. I had and will always be influential, not by the strength of my fist. Papa, please. I love DK. He makes me laugh all the time. I want to be with him. Will you shut up? Woman! You must talk some sense into your daughter's discord. She must never be seen with that boy again. I believe you know the implications of this. What do you mean? What do you mean by implication? <coughs> Nobody should touch the girl! Nobody should touch the girl! Who am I? 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 That you sold me out at birth. Oh, is that why Papa is successful? He traded me for what? It's not like that. I and your father had no choice. Look, Mama, I don't care whatever agreement you had with the king. I will not marry the prince. Eh? No, no. Who am my Papa? Who am I? Hey, what kind of game? I know you'll be here. What are you doing here all by yourself? Nothing. Nothing? We've never been here alone. And this is our playground, do you know? It's true. I just wanted to be alone. That is not true. What is the matter with you? Are you avoiding me? No. Then why haven't I seen you for two days now? I... 
I have been in the farm with my mother. Okay, she says so. You know today is my match schedule. I know. And why haven't you come to wish me well, as usual? What difference does it make? You will always be victorious, with or without me. After all, you are DK, the strongest of all men. Don't say that. You are my strength. You are the reason why I'm always victorious. Each time I sit, all I think is how to put a smile on this beautiful face of yours. I now discover that victory makes you happy. That's why I always return bearing victory. Please tell me, what is going on with you? You won't understand. Excuse me, are you crying? Everything is fine. Is there anything you're not telling me? All is well. <laughs> Uwema, please. Who is making you to cry? You know what I can do. Just tell me the truth. Who is hurting you? No one. You love me. And I can never do without you. I know. You're my strength. Please tell me the truth. Okay? Alright. Come. There's something I will show you. from. He's an indomitable lion. So sweet and handsome. I can't help but wish. It's my husband. Ugo, what is wrong with you? How? I don't understand. I'm warning you. Stay away from Dike. Why? He is free and... Wait a minute. Don't tell me that you have feelings for Dickie. You know you've been betrothed already. Shh. Shut up your mouth. Stay away from him. Yeah. I don't want to Wait for me. What have I done again? Uri, Uri, ma. Lucky indeed. Of all the beautiful maidens in this kingdom, she's the only one choosing for honor. I wish I would be like her. Ibubi. Ogonna. I hope all is well. I overheard you talking about Urema. I hope nothing bad has happened to her. No. How can something bad happen to our future queen of this kingdom? What did you just say? Future Queen? How? You're the only one in this kingdom who doesn't know that Urema is getting money to the prince. Are you sure of what you just said? You all know that lying against the prince of this land could one be killed! this to me. We've been friends since we were children. Why do you have to keep a secret from me? Why? You know there is nothing about me that you don't know. Ugo, I'm sorry. I love him. It's improper for me to be seen around DK. 
I am foolish to have kept it away from you. Please, forgive me. Was that why you wanted to eat me alive the other day? Just for admiring Dike? So all along, you've been seeing him? Yes. And I love him so much. So, what do you intend to do now that you know that you've been betrothed to the prince? That is why I am here. Please, help me. That's why I'm telling you all this. Have you told Dike? No. Why, Urema? Why did you become so secretive? I'm afraid. I can't tell him. Because I don't know how he's going to react to it. DK can be crazy sometimes, you know. Oh, Urema. What have you gotten yourself into? Go, please, you're my best friend. Help me. Don't worry. We'll take care of it. But you have you have to tell Diggy before he finds out. What do you take me for? A fool? No. So all this why you told me you loved me? You've been seeing the prince behind me. No. I have never seen nor talked with a prince. You are the one I love. Don't oh. touch me! You are so wicked. <laughs> so all this why we've been together, you still want to marry another man? And to make the matter worse, I heard it from people. <laughs> DK, please understand me. <laughs> This thing was prearranged before I was born. You are the one I love. What is there to understand? It's you that I now, love. If I ever hear that from you again, I will kill you this minute. Dear, yeah, please. For your information, you now belong to the prince. He is my master. He's richer than me. Isn't he? Now get out! I don't want to see you again! Get out! <laughs> Son, yes, father. You know it is time for you to meet your wife today. But I don't know how prepared you are. I'm ready, Your Highness. I almost cannot wait to meet my wife, the future queen of this kingdom. Oh, good. You are a chip of the old block. You see, when I look at you, I only see my uh, youthfulness in you. You know that the future of this kingdom is in your hands. But you are yet to be married. Women are very influential. If a man succeeds, ask the wife. If a man fails, ask the wife. That's why we have groomed Uremba. Prepared and groomed only for you. <laughs> Thank you very much, Your Highness. I believe in your choice. You are the king. You are the greatest king of this kingdom. You are wise. You are strong-willed. Everything I am today, you made it possible. I will forever fetch from the endless stream of your wisdom. I will rule this kingdom like you even when you're long gone to our ancestors' bosom. That's good. That's why you are my son. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Your Highness. It is well with you, my son. It is well with you. Mbafo, I'm going to get something. Make sure you finish all the domestic chores. 
Mama asked me to do. Huh? Good. Come on, get inside and do what I ask you to do. DK! DK! Why did you invite me to your house? I thought you said you don't want to have anything whatsoever to do with me. Is that why you too. sold yourself so cheap to the press? Don't talk to me like that. What's whatsoever to do with me. I never sold you? myself out to anyone. Yes, you did. Give me one That's reason why you want to marry the press. Because it's rich and I'm not. Stop. Because it's the press and everyone's dream. DK, stop. I will not stop. I'm not. All right, go ahead because and yell at me. Keep shouting, don't you ever stop. All right, go ahead and yell. I want to marry the prince. Do you know why? Because he is rich. No, do you know why? Because he can take care of me. Because with the prince, I will have all the power that I need to teach you how to respect a woman. Oh, I can see you've grown wings. To teach you? Yeah. You now talk to me the way you like. Isn't it? That's what you want from me. Talk to me, me the way you like. Is that why you invited me to your house? Hey, I called you because I want to be with you. Very soon I will not have the opportunity to leave me by yourself. I love you, DK. I want you to understand that none of this is my fault. I love you. My son. Can you do me a favor? What? What? Are you alright? Yes, I'm alright. No, you are not. Because if you are, you will not ask me for that. Knowing that my body belongs to my husband. Knowing that my body. You are getting on my nerves, please. I'm leaving. No, you're not. You're not. Nothing. Yes. B 
because I know I'm not going to marry you. I'm not going to marry you. Grandma, are you stupid or something? Please don't even say that again. Because if you do, you and your family will not live to tell the story. What do I do? <laughs> We and must marry the prince. Yes. What about my virginity? What about my virginity? You see, my friend. Today is the prince's day. And I'm very much sure that you'll be drenched in alcohol. Get hold of him. Don't let him escape tonight. I so do it. Yes. <laughs> Sorry, my dear. It's okay. DK. DK. You're my queen! Are you my lord? Yes. <laughs> I don't know. Am I drinking or am I chopping it? Which one am I doing? I'm drinking, drinking. Is it drinking? I, I want to I want to chop you. Oh, I'm drinking. Drink. 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 If it's my friend, let me drink. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> You're the most beautiful woman I've ever seen <laughs> in this entire kingdom. Yeah. Hey! <laughs> 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 Are getting out of hand. How do you mean? You're pregnant. That you're pregnant? Is that why your face is like that? Do 
Don't you know there is a good news? The prince will be the happiest of all men. I hope you know that. Go stop. <laughs> you and I know too well that this pregnancy does not belong to the prince. If I had known, I wouldn't have gotten married to him in the first place. I would have married him. What are you talking about? Do you know the shame and disgrace you would have brought upon your family if you had not married the prince? <laughs> because it's getting worse by the day. I don't know what to do. Don't, don't worry then. Right. There is nothing in this life that doesn't have a solution. Trust me. All I want you to do right now is to calm down. You will think of something to do. Mm -hmm. Alright? Okay. You will definitely think of it. <laughs> Indeed, you are the son of my lawyers. I am proud of you. Thank you very much, Father. Listen, I never wasted time to bring you into this world. And you are like your father. You have done very, very well. Oh, may the gods be praised. That's to say, even if I join my ancestors, I will have nothing to regret. I will be a fulfilled man, knowing fully well that I have someone to take after me, someone to answer my name. <laughs> yes. I greet you once more, Your Highness. You are indeed a blessing to my life. You will live long to see your grand and great grand children. Oh, so be it. <laughs> Say yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> What is the matter? Why are you so happy? What happened in the palace? You happened, my wife. Me? Oh, yes. How? You're pregnant, my wife. <laughs> How do you know? Oh, no. Even if I'm not a woman, that doesn't mean I can't detect the early signs of pregnancy. How did you know I'm pregnant? Was that why you kept it away from me? No, I I wanted to be sure before. I am sure my wife! I am sure you're pregnant! Oh my god! Thanks to our ancestors! I'm going to be a father soon. Come on, my wife. Thanks for proving I am a man. <laughs> Thank you, my wife. I love you. Yes. <laughs> my lord, you don't have to do this. What? I don't deserve all the gift you are showering on me. Just because I am carrying your baby. I need this baby as much as you do. And I owe you a lot for making me feel like a real woman. Even at that, I don't see anything wrong. Buying things for my wife. For making me proud. I know my lord. I have lots of things. Even the ones to spare. I think we have a lot of people in our kingdom that need this more than I do. Are you rejecting my gifts? No, my lord. Please. Can I have it? Thank you, my lord. Thank you, my friend.
Ugo, I'm tired of all this. I don't understand my husband. What is it, Rem? His attitude towards me and my unborn child makes me uncomfortable. How do you mean? Is he not happy about the child? He is. And how is that a problem? It's a problem because he showers me with lots of gifts. Hmm. If you're tired of receiving gifts, why not push them to me? Hmm? Why are you making a joke out of all this? How can I lead him on? Knowing that I'm carrying another man's child. I feel like a hypocrite. Receiving those gifts. Knowing that I don't deserve them. Calm down, Rema. No one even knows that the child is not princess. As soon as the child is born, they will know. Because he or she will not look like my husband. Can't you see? Hmm. Don't worry. We'll find a way out. Are you sure? Yeah. Yes. Do something about it. What can I do without you? It's alright. What are friends for? Come, come and see me. Huh? Stay with me a little bit. My please. husband will start looking for me. Every time your husband, your husband. Okay. Like that. Come, my daughter. Hey, Mama, what is it? I overheard everything you discussed with your friend. Huh? Yes. Mama. Mama, what and what did you hear? Everything. I heard everything. Since you've heard everything, what do you intend to do? Expose her secrets? No, I don't want to expose her secrets. Oh. Okay, Mama. Since you don't intend to expose her, why are you telling me all this? My daughter, I don't want to expose her. But even if we do, it's going to be at our own advantage. Eh? Can't you understand? Especially you. How, Mama? Advantage. I want to go and see my friend. Uh huh. Mother, please come, my daughter. Sit down. <laughs> my daughter, have you thought about what I told you yesterday? I can't believe this, Mama. Wait a minute. Are you truly my mother? Of course I am. If you're truly my mother, how would you ask me to betray my childhood friend? Please, my daughter, don't think like that. I just want you to take advantage of this situation and change our life. Now, you and I, eh? And it doesn't bother you how my friend will feel about that. Mama, I am so surprised that this is coming from you. I am going out. Probably when I'm back, I must have forgotten that you suggested that. 
Uh -huh. Please, as you are going, think about that. Hmm? Think about it too. and tell me what the problem is. What is it? I think he knows. Who knows? Did you tell him anything? Tell who what? What exactly are you talking about? I think my husband may have discovered my secret. How? No one knows except the both of us. Yesterday he got drunk and almost confronted me with it. Drunk? Why did you start listening to a drunkard? He may have been drunk, but he spoke with conviction. He said that a secret is never safe with anyone except in itself. So, did you tell him anything? How dare you, Rema? I am your very best friend. Everything that will betray you. You mean after all these years, you still don't trust me? Sorry, now I'm just asking. Do you mind the kind of question you ask me? I'm sorry, but if you did not tell him who did, have you asked Dicky? Dicky? Uh -huh. No, I didn't ask him. Oh, I have not. You should ask him. Hey, you can have finished. Hey, DK. finished me. My lord. What is it that you want to tell the people first? That you don't want to tell me? I am your wife. You can confide in me. You don't have to worry yourself, my lovely wife. All I want to say is for my well-being and that of our unborn son. <laughs> and who told you he's a boy? Of course I know. I'm a lion. And I should beget a lion. <laughs> My elders, you are welcome. Yeah. I know some of us uh, might be wondering why an impromptu someone at a night like this. But I want you to know that I am as surprised as you are. But, um, this someone was at the instant the prince who said that he has something he wants to tell us. So, Prince, we are all ears. Speak. Thank you, Father. It is well with you. I greet you all, my people. You are welcome. You are welcome. We all have to be grateful, as well as to the ancestors, for giving us a king like this. A king with so much wisdom. A king with so much love in his heart. A king that sleeps and wakes up with his people in his lips. Father, we're grateful for you. It is well with you, my son. I also want to thank our ancestors 
for giving me a beautiful woman. Like this. A woman with a great nature. A woman with a rare nature and quality that gladdens my heart. As you all can see, she didn't waste time in taking in for me, thereby consummating my joy and happiness. I want to commend her for honoring me that way. And that is why I want to make this announcement. I want to tell you all how disappointed I am. How humiliated I feel to know that my wife is with another man's child. What? It's unbelievable. What? Hey. What did you just say? Yes, father. I found out two days ago that she was never a virgin before I married her. Pronounce that from today onwards, that Urema ceases to be my wife. Never should it be heard, nor said that she was once my wife. And I forbid you all to say so. How did you come about that information? A beautiful woman who has my interest at heart. Who wouldn't let calamity fall upon this great kingdom? Called me and told me about it. And who is the responsible? Her name is Ugo. And she even told me that my right hand man, DK is responsible for my wife's unborn child. DK. You want DK? Yes. Gus! He will, he will go and fetch out DK, throw him and his family out of this kingdom. Banish them. Take them beyond this uh, community. They will never be seen in this land again. And uh, um, my elders, you have seen it? When I told you earlier that uh, I have no idea of this impromptu summon that such a evil is being committed in this kingdom, it is a slap on my face. It is an evil deed that is punishable by death. You know that we have a tradition which our great grandfathers followed and transcended to this our age. And that way must be followed. And this is not, there is no proof on this. No proof. I have spoken. Hold yourself. Guess you will take her from this community beyond to the evil forest. And between the evil forest and the EOG, when you get there, behind her, throw her into the river so that this evil. This evil and belly will not see the light of the day. Do you hear me? Yes, yes Igwe. Yes, and if you fail to do it, you will pay with your life. I also want to let the whole kingdom hear that from now onwards, Ugo is now my wife. You may kill my body, but you cannot kill my spirit. Hugo was my best friend. She betrayed my trust. Hugo, you would die a miserable death. And it would never be well with you wherever you are. Guards! Take it away from here! 
Shame to me. <coughs> I won her. Yet she did not listen. Yet I won. Now look at what she has done to my reputation. Huh? <laughs> Your only daughter is being sentenced to death. And you are here talking about reputation. Woman. I'm, 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 I'm finished. I am a respectable person in this kingdom. Do you know how long it took me to build it? A little disobedient child. Took it and destroyed it in the day. <laughs> so now that the only daughter is going to face death. Does that mean anything to you? Eh? She's the only daughter or your only child. What Urema did <laughs> is an abominable act. <laughs> if not for the kind-heartedness of the king, <laughs> you and I would have followed her to suffer like that. I would have preferred going with her. I would have preferred it than, than staying here and talking to you. Now you are heartless. You are so wicked. No wonder she refused to marry him. No wonder. You are a disappointment. A disgrace. I don't even want you to be called a father. Thank you. 
I go. Where is the other gun? Your Highness, we were attacked by some mean bush men. I am lucky to have escaped. Attacked? Yes, Igwe. On your way coming back or when you are going? Igwe, on our way coming back. Oh, it is a pity that the other guard wasn't as lucky as he is. But the, the important thing is that the mission of which they were sent was properly accomplished. Yes, I hope it is accomplished. Yes, Igwe. Yes. We beheaded. Uh -huh. Oh, good, good, good. Um, don't worry. I will reward you bad for it. Even the family of uh, the other guy, I will reward them. Thank you, Your Highness. May your days rain fruitfully. Now get up and go and clean yourself up. You must have suffered a lot of humiliation and shame. You are right, my daughter. You are responsible. You are both equally smart. Your father would have shown the same thing. I have a very rich family that has been nine families. I will take you to the land and show you so that whenever you want to farm, can start from anywhere, and nobody will challenge you. This is my life. Thank you so much. You are indeed a father. May our ancestors protect you. I protect you too. Uh, uncle, when are you taking me to the You can see that the weather is not planned. If you listen very carefully, you hear the thunder rumbling to the west. But whenever the thing stops, whether tomorrow or next, I'll take you to the land. Okay, what is it? What is it? I don't know what is wrong with him. With who? DK. What happened to him? Do you know that food you kept for him since morning? Uh -huh. He has not taken it. I tried talking to him, but he's not responding. Why? I don't know. Where is he? He's inside the hut. She no longer going with us. Of course he is. Where is your brother? Uh, I, I think he should still be sleeping. By this time? Ha! But he's not like him though. The guy I know too well always likes to be the first in everything he does. Please go inside and check if he's there. Call him, let's go. He's late already. Go inside and call him now. Huh? Hmm. 
Aku? Hmm. Nek. I can't find DK. I can't find DK in this court. You can't find DK in None of his belongings is here. Why? Did he run away or what? DK! Okay. What is it? Hmm? What is it? I can't find the key. Hey! Uncle! Where is the key? Where is the key? Uncle, Uncle the key is missing. The key! Uncle! Oh, the key! Hey! The key! Aja! What is it? Eh? Aja! What is it? Where do you think you're going? I am going hunting. <laughs> Since when did you become a hunter? Since the day they killed my brother. Oh, Nobody killed him. Your brother is missing. No, no. You don't understand. My brother is not just missing. They killed my brother. They killed my brother the day they stripped off all his armor. They killed him. He couldn't stand the shame. That's why he ran away. And I must find him. I can't afford to lose you! No, no, I cannot die a coward! I must go and get my brother, wherever he is! You're not going anywhere. No, step aside. You have to kill me! No, step aside! What, what, is, going going what is going on here? What is going on here? What is it? No, I am not a coward. Nobody has said so. How can I pretend to believe it? Why the killers of my brother are out there enjoying themselves? Eh, nine? Am I a coward? How many of them do you intend to kill before they kill you? Oh. I don't care, uncle. I don't care. I want to keep trying until I die or I get them. Don't be stupid. We are a family of brave men. We are no cowards. Bravery is in our blood. Nobody has ever shown act of cowardice in this family. Now, your brother was not killed by anybody. He just took a decision that befits a brave man. <laughs> Why? He has, where he is staying now, I'm sure he's planning what will be his revenge when he comes out. No, Nai. Nai, no! What, what is the no, no, no? Oh, Nai, I must go after the killers of my brother. I must! Unless you are going to look for something else. I must avenge for my brother's death. I am no coward! Today, I swear by the sun! to avenge my brother's death. And no matter where you are, I must find you. Let the sun smit me by the day if I do not avenge your death. I, Aja, from Ogodo Kingdom, I stake my life for your vengeance. I will not waste until your killers, I see their blood spill on the ground. I will not rest. That's a, that's a good uh, statement from your brave son. Yes. My daughter, nobody's going to kill you. Just relax. Relax. You will laugh at last. Don't worry. Go inside and relax. Go and rest. Hmm? Yes. Are you going? Yes, I want to go and rest because I'm a bit sickly. Pardon us. If he had known that, 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 that one, that DK is his and the heir to the throne. What? Huh? I was scared because the king of a 
Godo was already married. I didn't know what he would have done if I had told him about it. <laughs> mama, mama, why? Why, Mama? Long time ago, there was war between the Ogodo Kingdom and the Ezekona Kingdom, which took the life of my father and that of my mother. The King of Ogodo told me to go with them to their camp so I can be preparing their meals for them. A woman like me, I had no option. I followed them. Oh, Nick, you are beautiful. Thank you. Yes. Hey, <laughs> bring it, bring it inside, bring it inside. <laughs> Where is Neka? Have you seen her today? No, Your Majesty. Is she not in her tent? We, we have checked uh, uh, the tent everywhere. We couldn't see her. This is quite unlike her. Why did she go out just like that? Upon all what I've been doing for this girl. You know she's a slave. But I don't treat her that way. Huh? Don't worry, Your Majesty. I will go and look for her and bring her back to this camp. You better be quick. Thank you, Your Majesty. Neka! Where have you been? We have looked for you everywhere. What happened? Why did you leave the palace without telling me? I'm very sorry, Your Majesty. I don't mean to leave. I was captured by the Naka warriors when I went in search of water to make your food. And uh, the little boy, who is? One among my captors forced me, married me, and I got this child in my years of servitude. Well, who is he? Where is he? He died. I don't have anywhere to go but to come to you. Neka, you are welcome to my palace. You see, we invaded your people. We killed them, even your parents. We took you captive. And don't mind you, you saved me when I was in distress. Neka, I owe you a lot. I will give you a home. I will give you a land to farm so that you and your child will be fed. You hear me? Mama, are you seeing? Are you seeing that another person is my father? Yes. Yes. 
Another man is your father. Hey, I got pregnant while I was still in the camp. I ran away from the camp and reappeared with my baby because I wanted to be close to the to my son's father. The king asked after his father. I told him he was dead. I was there and got married to your father. It was when I gave birth to you. Hey! Mama, and you kept this from us all these years. You kept this from us all these years, Mama. Why? I didn't know what to do. You, you've seen what everything cost us now. Oh. You've seen what everything cost us. Yes, if DK had known the truth, DK would have been alive to fight for that which belongs to him. Now DK is gone. Urema and her unborn baby are gone too. And you're saying it now. Sorry, Mama, you're saying it now. I'm sorry, my son, forgive me. Why? Please. Oh. <laughs> Very secretive on this. Why? Please, I didn't know what to do. I was confused.
My child. <laughs> You're so young and innocent. <laughs> I believe in what you will become. <laughs> I know you will make me proud. <laughs> May the God of my ancestors as a Chukwoki Kapiam protect you, sustain, and guide you. I will be with you in spirit. No man can kill you. Ogo? Ogo? Mãe! Ogo? Mãe. Just listen to me. I've lived with you for so many years here. And you refuse to give me a child. You refuse to prove your fertility. To me. I'm tired and sick of staying with you. Yes. Nah, it's not my fault. You married me a complete woman, don't I? And so? Then there must be something wrong with your lineage. Yes! I begin to think that you and your family have come vanity. With the gods, never to give me a child. Mm. Yes. And you have been hiding it from me. No, it's not true. I can still give you a child. When? Until when I die. Then the child will come, isn't it? Mm. Okay? Now listen to me. I'm going to somewhere now. I'm going to the farm. And I wouldn't like to see you here when I come back. No, All you have to do now is get inside here, pack your things, no. go back to your father's house. I'm oh, begging see you. you when I'm back. No, please. Please I what? I can give you a child. When? Now. Oh, oh. Now, now, now. Yes, I'll give you now. Please. <laughs> you give me a child. Something no. you have never done for years. Now you are going to do it today, today. Let me up.
don't even know your name. I don't know who you are. But this day, this day will be lingering in my heart. Thank the gods for this gift to your child that you gave to him. I will keep it and I will give it to him when he grows up. Rest in peace. Go in peace. anything to do with a man for for over 25 years. But I still feel as if I'm pregnant. It is a mystery. It is a mystery. It is a mystery. Mystery indeed. Hmm. We need to consult a spiritualist. A spiritualist? We cannot sit down here and speculate more thinking. We need to get to the bottom of this. So yeah. when do we go? Now. Then let's go. I'm not getting any ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm prepared already. Let's just go. Let's go. child. Not just a child, but a great child. But that does not mean that you are a child. Then what does it mean? Hmm, nine. All I can see is a child from your first son. My son's child? I don't understand. You have a child from your first seed. A grandchild from your first seed. A great child from my first seed. Where's my... How can it be possible? Who hmm? Rema was killed with her unborn child? The gods of ancestors does not lie. The child we are not killed. But, but, great one, I am very sure, I am very, very sure that the king and the elders ask them to be killed in the evil forest. Mm -hmm. Young man, the ways of our ancestors are mysterious. So, where are they? <laughs> Chungwele, chungwele, ngwele, 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 ngwele
Tanamata kumpian pia amuke. The God of ancestors, the God of the land. Show me where they are. <laughs> She gave up her life for the child to live. She has gone to the land of the dead. Mm -hmm. So now you can go in search of the child. Aja, you heard what the spiritualist said. That's why I have brought two warriors to help you in the search. You must never lose your concentration. You must have patience when you can't find them. As you walk along, you must be courageous and determined that you must accomplish your mission. I have heard you, Uncle. The gods are kind. They would never let Sticker's name be wiped away. That is why they preserve his seed. Go! Bring him to me. I will, Mama. I will. I promise you. He is the heir to the throne and not Obiora. May the ancestors protect you. I see. May you go and come back in one piece. You will go to Mire, the great little doctor. He will fortify you for this journey. You will accomplish your mission. See, see, go and bring him back. Ah, 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 yeah. Ah, yeah. DK, ah, yeah. Aye, 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 DK, aye, aye, Bonique, aye, aha, aye, aha, aye, DK, aye. You have been fortified. You will never lose strength, nor get old until. Your mission is accomplished. The ways of the gods are mysterious. <laughs> Go! Go! Hmm. Stop there! Stop there!
Organic. 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 What happened? They. What, what is happened? the problem? What is the problem? Where is my they, son? They, 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 they were taken away. By who? We were caught. By strange looking men. I barely escaped with my life. Are you saying my son may be dead by now? Is that what you're telling me? I don't know. This man. The Harayon sticks with them. And these things bring smokes and sand. Hey! Boy! Boy! Hey. I nearly escaped with my life. Let me show you. Listen. Hey. Can you see this? Hey. If I plant it in your face, you'll be a dead man now. Hey. It's okay, it's okay. Don't hey. count like that. Hey. 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 You couldn't hey. even speak. Hey. Are you mad? Hey. My daughter, get off. Get off. get off. Get off. Get off. Where's my son? Where's my son? Wait, 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 wait. Nani, Nani, what do I do? Start feeling yourself now. You cannot hold this for some seconds. Since you cannot concentrate on the task ahead, you cannot be a lion. Yes, whatever a lion wants, it gets. Why? Because it concentrates on the task ahead. So, bend down and carry this.
respect for elders in this kingdom anymore. Ikoro, or whatever you're called, get out of my way. Hmm. Today, I will break your bones. Ikoro, get out of my way. Dimba! I challenge you to a fight! Ikoro! Leave my way! I am 
Zumba. I fear no man. Tell me why he disobeyed me. I am waiting for him to come back. Papa Grace. Hey! Come, 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 come here. Where do you think we are going to? Stand here. Stand! Yo. Why? Why, why did you disobey me? you do you know Ikoro was doing this even before you were born and you went to challenge him yes you may have won the fight but your victory was a flick do not turn to ever disobey the gods that give I make myself clear. Right? Ikoro. Yes, yes, I know him. What happened to him? He did you see the way he was defeated at the wrestling match. What? Please stop joking. How can you tell me that? Do you know who Ikoro is? Nobody can defeat this man in this land. Please. Yes. Okay. let me tell you. I thought so until I saw the way Dingba threw him on the ground like a child. And who is Dingba? Dingba now. Dingba Bioza son. Oh, 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 that boy, if you see the way he threw him on the ground, it's not true. By telling me that Dimba defeated Ikoro in a wrestling contest is a lie. I don't believe you. Only that Dimba, he's so strong. That boy is strong. I still don't believe till I see with my two eyes. I don't believe you at all. Please, please, please. I don't believe you. Okay, don't worry. He has another match tomorrow. You see him. He I does. No problem now. <laughs> we'll see to it. Better come and help me out there. Sure. Dimba, I have warned you, but you wouldn't listen. One day, you'll get yourself killed by those wrestlers. But Papa, I'm strong. You are strong what? You are foolish. Yes. I won't allow you to get yourself killed by those wrestlers. Now listen to me. First thing tomorrow, you go to my sister's husband's village and stay with them. Hmm? Until when I get satisfied, they are mature enough to face whosoever that comes your way. Papa, I think I made myself clear. Papa, I don't want to go to your sister's You place. must go there. You must! I have spoken. Now get inside.
boys harvest every crop here. Harvest anything that is growing here. First. First. I am Okanga, the great Iroko. I am my own god. Hurry up. Paul, what is happening here? Hey. What do you think that you are doing? Come on. Hey! Get down from my Hey, 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 hey! Are you mad? Are you mad? Okanga, this is my land. I planted everything here. And so what? I will not be alive to see you eat the fruit of my labor. Hey! Shut up. Don't you know who I am? Don't you know that I'm a Kanga? Get out of my land. Are you not scared of me? I will not leave. I, I will not. Are you mad? Oh, Kanga. You go must get this. Get out of here! You go must get this. You will, you will regret it. Get out! I will deal with you. I am a Kanga! I will deal with you. The great hero country. Continue with what you're doing! Continue! <laughs> I've lost everything! 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 No book at Libya! Oh, no book at Libya! Hurry up! Okanga! 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 So the Igwe asked you to come and drag me to this palace? Hmm? Okanga! You must go with us! And if I refuse to follow you, what will you do? Huh? Then we will drag you! <laughs> How can two weak minded people like you drag a strong man like Okanga? Are you mad? Okanga, you are wasting the king's time. Oh! Listen! Hold on. Go and tell the Igwe to call my match! Come and drag me to his palace. That is, if there is my match in this kingdom and beyond. And also tell him that I am nobody's slave. I am certain no one. My name is Okanga. Alubaruku Nejuanu. Get out of my house. Go on! Go on, Next time you'll be here that name Okanga. Go back. Are you now telling me that you have agreed on what Udemezo said? Of course. I agree with what Udemezo said. You and I have witnessed Dimwa defeat the strongest of all men in this kingdom. Now tell me, Obiozo, why do you think he cannot do the same to Okanga or who do, what, whatever you call him? Obaka, <laughs> you won't understand. Okanga is evil. And then, didn't you see what he did to those energetic gas? And my son is still a small boy. He's not ready yet. And that is why I sent him out. You know my son is a very stubborn boy. Okanga cannot kill Dimwa. You are only being afraid. You're just being afraid. But... Let Dimwa rest and humiliate Okanga. Back, I will not. After all, there are some stronger 
youths littered everywhere in our, in, in our kingdom. You can take one or two to go and face Okanga. I don't want Okanga to kill my son for me. None of them is like Dimba. I said no. I have watched Dimba. And I know he is definitely going to humiliate Okanga. So, please give it a thought. Do you know what happened yesterday? No, tell me. Do you know what happened yesterday? Fuck now. That's, uh, what is his name? That stupid boy. Oh, I'm not going to do Uju, so you know. Hey, go, go, go. See, Uju and Akuna. What of you? Stop. Every time you people be gossiping around this, when will you both get tired of gossip? Eh, hey, call it there. Look at this useless wonder house, wandering up and down the village, looking for where to make troubles. What is your business? Even if we are gossiping. What you just if want? we are gossiping, is it your business? Yes. Listen, Igenda, if you don't have anything to say, eh? Please leave us here. Leave us alone, no, Igenda. You this shut up. Shut up. Look at them. Shut oh. up. Look, say, wait, wait. Look. Did you see? Okay. I will be there, right? Fools. Shut up. All I have for you, for, for two of you, is that one day, mm. both of you will go to Inwest Palace and tell the whole community. What you both have been discussing? <laughs> Why not tie our hands and drag us to this West Palace? Tying your hands is not a problem. Somebody will come and bond you both of you one day to the West Palace to tell the whole community what you both have Look at them. my son and my name is Okike I'm just coming from your place they say you went to farm your brother Ichio Biozo sent me to you I hope all is well with him yes 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 so that Dimba should come home Dimba should come back home Dimba is done with me Dimba that left home months ago to your place is not with you I've not seen Dimba for a long time my son, you can go home. I'm coming over to see my brother. All right. My brother's only son. Could it be that Dimba has been missing? Just look at me. 
Take a look at me. Do I look younger? Hey, tell me. Do I look younger? I will have another. Stay give me another. But you're a man, Ukyozo. Men are as old as they feel. So, you are young. Only when you feel you are young. Mm -hmm. So, my friend, get hold of yourself. Yes. I know. I know, you, I, I know you will say this. Because you have them. Isn't it? You have them many. You have children. One by you are numerous wives. And what stops you from getting married to another? Since Ogo has refused to get pregnant for you, what stops you from getting married to a younger woman who will give you as many children as you want? Please, get hold of yourself. You can have children if you want to. Or, do you want to follow the mother to the grave? My friend, please. Like I said, get yourself together.
to the liver. No matter how small, it produces ripples. Yes! <laughs> the monkey is saying he is wise. The monkey claims to be wiser and smarter than man just because trees are close to each other. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Take one of the trees and keep it at Obola Afonsoka and the other one at the Konuwa Market. <laughs> Let us see <laughs> how smart the monkey is. When an animal has an embrace with a biogu, his face tells the story. <laughs> Okanga has beaten more than he can chew. Okanga has beaten more than he can chew. And that was why I invited you people here today. Yes. We all know Kanga is a very strong wrestler. Yes. We know he has been defeating people for ages. But his arrogance and lack of respect to the king of Dunaka Kingdom and the entire people of Dunaka Kingdom. His stupidity and arrogance has gotten not only into my nerves, but the nerves of the gods of this land. That was why I invited you here today for us to have a wrestling match. Yes! Person becomes the heir apparent to the throne. <laughs> Igwe. 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 I've spoken. Now let the wrestling match begin. Stop! I can see that Igwe misunderstood me. But I don't care!
strongest wrestler and the strongest warrior in this kingdom. Is there no one else? Yeah, no one else! You lie! Okay, guy! You have insulted yourself! What are the gods of this kingdom? Okay. Mm. Huh? 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 I think I'm here for you! <laughs> you lie! What is wrong with you? Are you out of your Who is after you now? Why are you running Why like you're running rabbit? like somebody is after you? Look, look, look at them. Nobody. Nobody is after me. Nobody. Ah. Why are you running as if someone is after you? He's I back. Wonder. He's back. That's why I'm running. Hey, who is back? Who is, who is back? Yes. Dimba. Hey. Dimba hey. is back in this village. <laughs> you are stupid. Though. Meaning? Dimba. Dimba that is there. I Come on! Let me ask you. Oh. What did you eat today? Are you, are you mad? Come, ah, don't, 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 don't touch me. I, I ate that one. Now. Ah. You see it? You ate that one. You see it? You ate that one. Hey! <laughs> no wonder the apple has blocked your head. That, that girl has blocked all your head. The apple opened my brain, opened my eyes and opened everything in me. Listen, let me tell you. Eh? All the young medics. Everyone at the village square now watching, seeing things by themselves, seeing things as in celebrating their eyes. Dimba lifted, uh, uh, what, what, what is that his name? Oh, Kanga. Throw him on the ground. Are you uh, serious? His eyes was running like this. Hey! Hey! Hey!
Yes. Your name is Dingba. You will face him tomorrow. Yes, tomorrow. And I want you, I want you to, to, to crush him. Teach him a lesson of his life. Show him that you are a son of a great hunter. Some way you know how to target the rest now and put him down. Remember, if you don't win, we will lose a lot. But if you win, that means we are rich. He didn't see me. Where has he gone to? Oh my God. 
Alors, tout le monde est Like a lion that you are. Whenever I see it, I develop a thought it even when I'm not angry. Really? Then join me. I would love to. Let's go. There's a man who wants to make life miserable for you. The man promised me that he will destroy you tomorrow. What is his name? His name is Agada. My name is Dimba. I fear no man. You see, I told him that. I told him that I trust my son. That my son will destroy him. And he's going to come back with great after the match. It's all right, son. You have to go and prepare yourself. The match will take place tomorrow. Go and prepare yourself. Get ready for him tomorrow. That's my son. <laughs>
warriors that have not disappointed the people in any wrestling contest or in any war expedition. And that is why other kingdoms come to pay homage to us every year. The people of Dunaka Kingdom. This is one of those opportunities most of you have been looking for to exhibit your dexterity in art of wrestling. And I know that by the time we'll be done with today's wrestling, all of you will be happy. And so, let the contest begin! Our great warrior, our fighter, who has gone far and wide and he has fought and has had a series of competition and he has won. We are talking about our brother, a son of the soil, a warrior, a fighter, a wrestler. Join me to welcome our brother, Agada. <laughs> Tonight is also our son, our friend, the man that has gone to the land of the spirit and fought. Still he won. Who am I talking about? This man is an unbeatable, is an indomitable fighter, a warrior, and the man that has gone so wide as far as wrestling is concerned. Join me to welcome Red Dimba!
Look at Look at me. To be honest with you, Papa, I don't really know what happened to me. If you, if you say that again, I will, I will break your head. You don't, you don't know what happened. Oh, yes, I know. I know what happened. Since you begin to associate yourself with Oledo, that weaker says, your mind begin to wake. Papa, I love her. I love her. You love who? Shut up! Great men don't fall in love. Yes, they don't! It's only fools! That fall in love. Yes. See, let me tell you. Henceforth, you will stop seeing that girl. Yes, something terrible will happen to you. Papa, how can you say a thing like, like, like that? I have spoken! Yes, Papa. What business do you have with Dimba? Dimba is my friend. Dimba is your friend? Yes, Papa. What kind of friend is he? I don't understand you. All I can say is that I love Dimba. Yes, Papa. When did this love start? Right from the first day I saw him defeat his opponent at a wrestling match, that was when the love started. Yes, yes, yes. Let me tell you, that love will stop immediately. Why? You ask too much questions. I'm your father. And let me tell you, you will not see Dimba again with your eyes. Say, leave this place. Get inside. Leave this place. Let me see you with Dimba again. And let me see that Dimba come to this my house. I will show him that I'm not joking. Dimba. Yeah. Dimba won't do. You kill, make sure I lose this my daughter. I didn't need to be that way. 
I don't know what came over my father. He said I should stop seeing you. What are you going to do? I won't stop being with you. Not I was going to disobey your father. I think I would do anything just to be with you. If it means me killing, I will kill for you. No, 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 no. You don't have to kill anybody. I won't stop seeing you. Obioso is determined to carry out his threats. He can't even listen to me. He wouldn't even consider that fact that his actions can destroy the one that he is seeking to protect. But how do I use this situation to my advantage? Hmm. This situation has to be for me. But how? What do I do? What? My Dimba in the village square. Hmm? If your man wins, then the land and two other lands become yours forever. But if Dimba wins, Oji, then the land and the cowries you lent me will become mine forever. <laughs> What is funny? Hey! Obaka. Eh? What is funny? You've not stopped being a fool all this year. Huh? Which Dimba are you talking about? It's not Dimba that I know. Is it not the one that was disgraced by Agatha the other day? Huh? Hmm. Or, or is there any other Dimba in this village? Oji, the Dimba we are talking about is the Dimba you and I know. Just go ahead and accept the challenge. Uh, remember you, you, you have already lost your land to me. Eh? Do you want to lose another one? Why do you refuse to be wise, Obaka? Why do you refuse to be wise? You are an elderly man. You are now the wisest man on this land. So, I can take any insult from you. But, I know, life is all about gain 
Or not? Oji, the way I look at you. You are afraid. Afraid of who? Listen. It's not that I'm a wise man. Look at me. I am not afraid. I can't be afraid of uh, Dimba. Uh, that boy is a small boy. He's then, a loser. He's a loser. He's a small boy. He's this. Oji, go ahead and accept this challenge. All right. All right. If that is the way you want it, if that is the way you want it, let it be. So be it. Make sure you take care of the house. Okay. Huh? Papa. You understand me? Okay, Papa. Um, I don't want to look for you when I come back. Make sure you are in the house. Okay. Do you Papa. understand me? Yes, Papa. Okay. But where are you going to? I want to go and join your mother in the farm Papa. and make sure our food is ready before we return. Where are you heading to? I hope you are not entering my compound. Che, I want to see all you do. For what? Why do you want to see her? You've been warned to stay away from her. I must see her, Che. There's something very important I need to tell her. Take that important thing to other men in the land and stay away from my daughter. Don't even try it. If you do, I will brand you a thief. You and I know what the king can do to a thief. You better get out of my compound for your own personal interest. Get out of my premises and ever enter it. Away. What is it? Of course, I'm standing on your way. Why? Why? What you're going to do? Is it really necessary? Then too bad. It's very, very necessary. Yeah? Because we are paid to do this. You're paid to do it? Yeah. What if I give you a good reason not to kill her? Shoba, what do you mean? Shoba, I don't understand you. If you had any reason at all, why didn't you say it in front of uh, Icho Biozo? Uh, After all, you were there when he sent us to do it. The reason is obvious. You know Icho Biozo, my friend. He's a very stubborn man. She spare me that. So I don't think you expected me to make this kind of conversation in his presence. Okay, uh, Ichobaka, 
Now, what do you want from us? Good question. I want to pay you so that you don't kill her. Ichi, why? And I have my reasons. And I would rather keep my reasons to myself. Uh, I hope you're not telling us to return the money we've already collected from Ethiopia. No, 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 that's not possible. Ah, no, no, no. You got it wrong. Keep the money you collected from Obiozo. I will even double the amount for you. But you have to do something for me. Good. You will kidnap her and take her to a place that I will show you. You double the money you said? That's what I said. Is your wagon? Okay, uh, we'll do as we said. Even if you want us to bring that to your house, uh, we'll do it. At first, you double the money. Double the oiche. Just do your job. Then you get your money. No, we are in now. We are in. Do your job. Just do your job. You get your money. That's the idea.
I'm impressed. Chubak, what is this next thing to do? Nothing. 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 You will stay here and look after her. For how long are we going to be watching after her? For as long as I want you to. Here. Chubak. What if it's your bosom? find out that we did not do as he instructed us. Do you think he will be happy? And how is he going to find out? And who is going to tell him? You? No. Do what I told you to do. I am paying you all for it. Meanwhile, go and change her clothes. Why? Why? Were you not told to bring her clothes as evidence? Then you killed her. Please, go and change her clothes immediately. I will see you boys later. Your mouth. Oh, it comes up. It comes up. You have to eat, oh. I won't eat. Why will I eat? I won't eat this food. See, you're not leaving this place very soon. Or you want to die of starvation. Why not kill me instead? Kill me! <laughs> I will be glad to do that. Then what's stopping you? Go on, do it! Listen, we are paid to keep you alive. If they pay us to kill you, we will be so happy to do so. So you better eat. Please, I beg you. I beg you, just let me go. I promise I will pay anything. Just say it, I will pay. <laughs> what do you have? Please stop making me laugh and eat this food. 
I'm not the laughing kind. I'll eat! Eat this food. dear friend to the cold hands of death but life has to go on i have to wipe my tears and move on but i want to move on with Dingwa. am i wrong to think of that no i'm not after all olido eats no more and i know that wherever she may be she won't be sad if i get close to Dingwa. she will be happy that her best friend took her place in her absence. Dimba. Oh, my sweet Dimba. How I have longed to be in your arms, to feel your warmth of your thick skin. I love you, Dimba. Go inside and get me water to wash my hands. It's as if you know that I'm standing. food specially for you. Yeah. Thank you very much. Welcome. I love your necklace. Necklace? It's 
Hold on. What's the meaning of this? Oh, oh, oh. Is that what you bought me for? Mm. Oh, yeah. I stand up and go with this thing. Just go. What have I done to you? Look, you have not done anything. Just take your basket and leave. Just leave this place. Look at this girl. Just thank your God that I'm happy. If not, I would have shown you. to insult me? No. I've come to remind you who you are. I know who I am. I have not forgotten who I am. Now leave. I should leave? Yes, or I live for you. What if I give you a prison to let me stay? Something like what? What if I tell you I know where she is? What did you just say? What did, I, what did you just say? Did you just say you know where she is? Just leave me. If you kill me, you won't see her again. Just let go of my throat. I'll take you to where you can find her. <clears throat> I'll take you. Take you to where you will see her. But then you will have to do something for me. What could that be? You will wrestle. You will engage in a wrestling match and win for me. To show your determination to see her again. A wrestling match? I told you, if you don't wrestle for me, you will not see her again. Hmm. And what kind of question is that? Eh? Is this not my land? Eh, actually, this land used to belong to you until you sold it to me. And I say I don't want to sell this land anymore. <laughs> you can have your money. You can have your money back. <laughs> I want back my land. I bought this land from you. I paid you or back. And I am not going back on that. I said I don't want your wretched money anymore. Oh, now my wretched money. You don't want to use your head. You don't want to use your brain. You don't want to be wise. I will do no such thing. Right. Both the money and the land do not belong to you. You're not going to see anyone. Dimba! 
carry this man out of this place. Mm. You will regret this, so. Are you still there? Cut off his head! You will regret this! Cut off his head! Are you still there? I'm, I'm telling you, you will regret this! Cut off his head! Take it to your... You will regret this! Idiot! You want to have land! You want to have land! Right. Let's go! Tomorrow is another day! Let me see your wretched feet on this land again! Then I will, I will, I will tell you, I will tell you what... Very well done. We shall see. We shall see. Get ready. There is someone who would want to meet you in a fight. Tell him I don't want to face him. Why? Because I'm tired. When did you start getting tired? Dimbo, I know, is never tired. He's always ready to defeat his opponent. Don't ever think of ruining this only opportunity you have to see your neighbor. Hey. This is the last time I will be doing this. After this, if you don't show me to my old lady, to my love, I will kill you with my bare hands. And I mean every word I say. And a slave to you just to behold the one I love. If you waste my time right now, I'm going to strangle you with my bare hands. Come and take me where she is. Take it easy, boy. I will take you to that place. I will take you to where they are holding her. But then, that is after one more match. Willing to take me there right now? Just, just let go of me. Take me to that place. <coughs> Let's go. Don't worry. Please, okay. Just don't kill me. I will take you to where she is. I will take you. Just. <laughs> 
I am tired of this whole thing. Who does Ichiobaka take us from? As children or what? Eh? I don't understand. What don't you understand? Has he been keeping to his promises? Has he? My brother, you are right. You are very right. He has not kept to any of his promises. Eh? Is that how to do business? You are asking me to ask me. Yeah, you can ask anybody. I don't, I don't care. Yeah, that man is playing with fire. That man is very greedy. Ever since we started this job, he has not paid us our money. Why? Why? So, what do we do then? So, what do we do? <laughs> we have to do it. Yes. <laughs> That's it. We have to do it. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. Why are you talking as if you don't know our initial assignment? We were paid by Ichu Obiozo to have her killed. What are you talking about? So what you're saying is that we should go and kill her? Look at what I say. Yes, of course. Except you still have your own money with you. See, eh? I don't even know what you guys are talking about. For me, I've spent my money. So I don't even know, I don't even have any place to go to find another money to refund the uh, YouTube. So it's better we go to that backyard there and kill that girl. I'm meet you, is what I'm saying. And I've equally spent my two. The only option we have now is to carry Ichi Obiozo's order to save our heads. Yes. You are right. Because I don't want Ichi Obiozo's trouble at all. Mm -hmm. Besides, Oledo have seen our faces. Hi. So if we let her go now, hi. Yeah? She will go and tell the entire community that we are the people that kidnapped her. Fear of what? So it's better we go there again. I'm saying it again, no. Oh. It's better we go there and kill her. I don't have money. One day I don't have. I don't. I don't even have any. Let's go, Yankee How? Let's go. So that will go let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Hi. Hey. Oh, no, 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 no. Chill back. How can I leave you? He's grave now, strangled. I'm going to show you all later. Okay? That is where we're going to. There's no need to divide it over this. Go and show me now. You think you can play with me? I will show you. If you misbehave now, I will strangle you here. Move, my friend.
this is how he wants to pay me back. I picked him, nurtured him, I fed him, and the only way he could thank me was to disgrace me. I'm going to show him my real complexion. I have nothing to lose. After all, he's not my blood. Yes. King sent for me. trust anymore. What did you do to your abductors? Hmm? Because I had them planning to kill you if I rescued you. Someone sent them. Someone who doesn't want I and Bimba to be together. Bimba must be bothered wherever he is now. to go into the village and fetch 
search for a friend. I'm the hunted. I can't come with you. What is her name? Her name is Ulo. She's the only one I can trust in that village. With her, we can reach out to Dimba. Okay. First thing tomorrow morning. Finish up with this yam so that you have something to eat up. Oh. Where is he? Dimba was accused of killing you. What? Shortly before I was brought here, they took him to the evil forest to be killed. No! No! This can't happen! Dimba must not die! Dimba cannot die! My no. Dimba can't die! No! no, 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 no. no. <laughs> Allah!
beg you, don't kill him. Please, I beg you. Who are you? My name is Oledo. I'm the reason why you want to kill him. Please let him go, I beg you. Young lady, we don't know you. The king sent us, and we must kill him. Come here, woman! Why kill him? Come! Drop it! Drop it! Uma, drop it! Uma! Untie him! Go and untie him! We live in time of war, and war teaches us how to war. Antelope were in charge of creation. It would have created feathers and wings for itself so that it could fly when hunted. Meaning, Meaning that things are the way they are, not because I wanted it to be so. knows that Obioso is the biological father of Dingba. You know, it's very difficult not to believe this man, considering what he put himself to just to see us safe. 
It's very difficult. Only even at that. Don't tell me you're taking his words. I don't know what to believe anymore. All I'm just saying is that we should be careful. Let's just be careful. Your Highness, hmm? I am very happy. Very, very happy. This evening, Dimwa and one other man brought in my missing daughter, Oledo. Oledo. Yes. Dimwa. Dimwa. Oh no. Dimwa, how? Dimwa. Dimwa. I was meant to understand that you were the one that brought back his daughter. Only. Yes, he will. Is that true? Yes, Your Highness. And who is this young man that is standing with you? He's my uncle. My uncle? Yes, his name is Aja. I met him in the slave camp. He will. Do you know that? The true of we all know in this village as my father. Mm. It's never my father. Uh -huh. Yes. I got to know in the prison when I met my uncle, Uncle Aja. Mm. Dimba. Your Highness. The gods have actually vindicated you. Mm. Before you came to remove the shame from the face of a darker kingdom, mm. I made a promise that whoever won Okanga in that wrestling contest would be the heir apparent to this throne. Yes. Mm. Mm. I cannot take back my word. Like I said before, I made a promise. You elders were dead that day. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> For wiping away that shame from our face. And for the fact that women are not allowed. To mm -hmm. Women are not allowed to become the apparent to this throne. I declare you right away the heir apparent to this throne. <laughs> <laughs>